just like that. Oh, he puts it in. One, two, three. He makes it quick and easy. Fantastic goal. Really, it was. Makes a slide through. Oh, he's got a man through a goal here. It's a stunning goal from Ovi. What is going on everyone and welcome to the best attacking custom tactics tutorial. At our last video we hit more than 1000 likes which is absolutely fantastic and it shows me how much you guys love these custom tactics series and most importantly it shows me that you understand how crucial custom tactics are in FIFA 15. Today, as I said before, I will present you guys the best attacking custom tactic in FIFA 15. You will use this tactic when you are down 1 to goals and you want to get back in the game. You want to put pressure on your opponent and score those important goals. If we smash 600 likes at this video, I will upload the best defensive custom tactic that you will use to keep a result and after that I will start with the individual custom tactics for each formation and that's something I know everyone is waiting for. The secret in this custom tactic will be the defensive values but let's start with the beginning with the speed and type of passes used in the build up play. We'll go with the same values as in our best custom tactic video and that's 75 and 67. We want fast passes and a combination of short and long plays. We'll also keep organized as an option because we do not want central defenders to get involved too much in the creative part of our attack. Moving now to chance creation, we'll go a bit more risky than in our best custom tactic video and we'll have 60 at each option here. We still want to keep some balance and not to have all our players run into the opponent's penalty area because that would leave us without anyone to provide the right passes or crosses. The free form option is a must in this attacking custom tactic. We want our players to switch places between each other thus surprising the opponent. Getting now to our most important aspect, we'll want to put pressure on the opponent but not go all in as another goal conceded would definitely mean losing the game. So 75 at both pressure and aggression will make your team have a higher line of defenders and put double or even triple pressure on the player that has possession of the ball. The team with will have a balanced value and we are still not rocking with the offside trap, we'll go again with the cover option because the offside trap is way too risky to use in this situation. Remember guys, use this custom tactic when you are down 1-2 goals and you want to put pressure on your opponent to get back into the game. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do, 600 likes would be fantastic. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe. My name is Ovi, see you later.